Hey guys, so I wonder if this quality looks worse or better because I'm vlogging on my phone today because I left my camera at home and then we decided we should vlog what we're doing right now. So mom's going to update you on something that's sad and then I'll update you on something that's happy. So, Okay guys, so um, Kai and Charlie, you know we lost our Doberman, I think it was back in April. Um, she was uh, 13 or almost just under 13, might as well have been 13. And she lived a very long and healthy life, um, but she was at the end of her road. And then Charlie, our lab, um, we were told for years that he just had fatty tumors, but it was actually cancer and it grew and grew and grew. And um, he was also 12 and so it was too old to operate, um, but he started, getting so bad um, on Sunday that he was suffering and we also had to make that horrible choice that every pet owner hates to make and I cried so hard my nose was raw for several days but in all that um, we are just a family who just loves animals and we still have our little teacup chihuahua who is 10 and our cat who is 13 and then Bella who's younger guinea pigs and the, the guinea turtle. pigs and the turtle and we just we just love to share our lives with them so anyway long story short Lauren has been praying for several years about a new puppy but it really wasn't timing because we were kind of maxed out with we want to make sure we can give our animals plenty of attention but in light of all the grief it became very obvious that we needed to open our hearts again to love and so now Lauren has the rest of the story Okay, I was wondering if you were going to just take over. I I was going to not shut up. Okay, so anyway, we've been looking for puppies, and I'm going to subscribe to my other two channels because I'll be posting videos on my guinea pig channel. I'll probably post going to, no, not right. On my, on this channel, I'll make a video, a vlog of picking him up, and then on my guinea pig channel, I'll make a Q&A about him that you guys will ask questions, and I'll answer them. And then on my personal channel, I will make a video, the story of Stitch. So it'll be a story of how we got him and everything in detail. So subscribe to all those channels. The links are down below. And subscribe to this one. But we went yesterday to look at some puppies. And we basically fell in love with one that I am naming Stitch. And um, like from Lilo and Stitch. And so we, he basically chose us. Just I don't want to get into detail because I don't want to spoil the other video that I was planning on doing. So... Basically, he chose us and he was the perfect one for us. So right now, we're actually gonna go shopping for him. But first, I need to turn in an application for Petland right there. So that's where we're going. So that way I can turn in an application because I need to get a job so I can provide for him. So yeah, just keep watching because we're gonna go shopping now. We're gonna wait till we make sure that- We got some stuff from Ross. I'll probably show a puppy haul on one of my other channels. We're at on the border now. Getting some food. And I'm gonna get these. Well, Dad, he met us here. So, our food is here. we went to the other Ross and I picked up one other thing I picked up some training treats and now we are on our way to Walmart um, she has to get some stuff for dinner and then I'm gonna see if they have Kongs because both Rosses that we went to had something like a Kong but the rubber was too thin and we were afraid that the puppy could chew through it and then choke so we're gonna try to see if um, they have other Kongs at Walmart so I'm in Walmart now and I'm getting this one I don't think I will get this today because it's like it's really really soft and he would chew it and like swallow it so but it's super cute so if you have small dogs that won't destroy things get it. We're home now. There's Emmy. Hi. So she's trying to follow me upstairs but she's not. I went to get these from downstairs because we already had these but they've never been opened so I'm going to include them in my puppy haul. And I'm about to film right now. Yeah? No? Okay. Look at this. 
It looks like my puppy, sort of. I mean, this is a French Bulldog, and I have a Boston Terrier Boxer mix. So, yeah, but he, um, same markings and stuff. I'm out of breath, and you can tell Bella's been on my bed. You can see her paw prints, and I'm about to film, and that's partly the reason why I have that there. So please go to my other channel, my guinea pig channels where I'll be uploading the haul. And then I'm going to be asking for questions in the comments to that video. So that way I can answer them when I get my puppy, which is going to be three weeks. So I don't know if I'm going to last that long. I really don't know. I need prayers because I already want him here so, 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 so bad. So this is really bad lighting right now, and I look weird, but I'm going to end the vlog right now. Um, I put all of the puppy stuff right there. Somewhere over there. I can't, I can't look and point, so, yeah. But I'm going to end the vlog because it's kind of late. <sighs> and, uh, yeah. I'm just sitting here on my phone about to edit this, and then I realized I didn't even close it. But I do want to show you guys um, the crate that the puppy will be staying in. And I know you can't see me right now, but you will when I turn on this light. Oh, okay, so here's the crate. It was Grandma Katie's crate when we um, were trying to sell our home. Uh, when we had showings, she would stay here in this crate. But she hates it, and so she doesn't even need to use it. So we're going to use it for the puppy because it's bigger than the other crate that I own that actually Bella sleeps in. That one is like that big. So it'd be okay when the puppy was little, but the puppy's gonna be like medium size, like up to my knee, up to there. So yeah, I think this will work, but I don't know if it is going to work when he's full grown. When he's full grown, I might have to use, um our Doberman's old crate because that one's like huge so I don't know but I want to put it underneath my desk oh hey Belle hey Bella um I want to put it under my desk there's my t-shirt okay so I have all this stuff right here but I actually think I'm gonna put the crate there I might put it here I don't know yet but I usually like to have my chair sitting on this side because when I do my makeup, I pull that over. Also, I noticed that this vest is great for walking at nighttime. Notice how it glows? Yeah. I didn't know that about it. It doesn't even say that. I don't even think it says that on the back. It doesn't even say. But I think that's really cool because then if I walk my dog at night and a car's like light flashes it, I think that's cool. But yeah, so I'm probably going to put it here. I'll move that probably over there. Move the chair over there. Have the crate under here. Uh, not totally sure yet. I might even put it over there in that corner. I don't know. Um, I don't really have any place over there to put it. Yeah, just gotta think about these things. I don't think about these things. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Also, comment down below if you like me vlogging on my phone better. Like, if you like the quality and the sound better. Because I do think the quality looks better. My preference. So if you guys like this better than when we vlog on our video camera. Which is there. Let me know because that one doesn't have the best quality ever. It kind of looks a little weird once you edit it and upload it. So, yeah, let me know if you like this better, and I'll vlog on this more. Here comes Noelle. You want to end the vlog with me? Yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Go and subscribe. Bye.